Good day, good day! How the fuck are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Hey, welcome. <laughs> we got a one up Wednesday. Well, you see two of them but it's one, all right? Uh, a couple of weeks ago, I went to the, uh, what is it? Fox Valley Diecast Club, uh, I don't know, third or fourth weekend of the month, I don't remember. But anyway, I did a uh, unboxing video and uh, I, I talked about Derek Twig. And, uh, and after the video, I, I got to understand Derek Nitro, RC. That's his uh, eBay seller name, and I couldn't pick it out. I don't know why I couldn't pick it out, but I got it now. So Derek Nitro RC, check him out on uh, eBay. He does uh, a lot of stuff on eBay, but he comes to the diecast meet, and uh, the other day, um, uh, the, the the other week, whatever weekend, um, he sold me these two pair of uh, mini gts and um it was the last two that he had and uh, he he gave them to me uh what he said quote i'll sell them to below cost so below cost so i picked these up uh and i'm like oh yeah i'll just uh you know take them and buy them and um you know later on sell them you know uh you know uh, that's what you know i'd like to do on rover land is is sell stuff too that I acquire. So um, I was, uh, and during the video, I said, yeah, I got one loose. And I showed this one promptly and uh, yeah, everything's kind of cool and hunky-dory. And then I set these together and I set them down. And then I realized when I put these on the shelf and I looked at the box here, I don't have this one. I don't have this one. Uh, this is the military camouflage, the Land Rover Defender 110 military camouflage from Mini GT. And I've done a video on this and very, very sharp. And uh, I've got a couple of other Mini GTs as well. Uh, they're on the top shelf up here, but you can't see them. So, that means that I did not buy these extra to sell because I don't have any. So, guess what that means on a one of Wednesday. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, before I open these, I was going to check to see if there was a magic number on these. They have the hologram 469. What's this one? 4592. You know what? I'm going to save... I'm gonna save the 469 one just because, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I don't know, although that one shakes a little bit more. I think they're kind of, other than that, they're kind of the same. So we're just gonna open up this one. How's that, huh? So this is a one of Wednesday as well as an unboxing, yes. Uh, set it free Wednesday, usually free it Friday is a lot of the die cast guys do. So very, very nice. I didn't really show this, and now that we've got the wrapping off, uh, we can kind of show this a little bit better. So this is the Land Rover Defender 110 uh, Malaysian Army, and I am not gonna even, Har, 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 Harmune Belglang. I don't know, I, I probably butchered that big time, because I just, yeah, I'm just not very good with the, my phonics. <laughs> So there you go. So yeah, yeah. So there it is. And you can see the holographic uh, sticker that they put on there, TSM models, uh, which is the Mini GT uh, is part of the Mini GT is part of the TSM model family. So very kind of cool. Uh, yeah, there is the Malaysia exclusive. That's kind of a neat little flag there. Crest, moon crest with a star. Yeah, and say 164 scale. This side seems to be wanting to be opened. And we're gonna have to turn it around this way. 
and pop this baby out. So this is exciting. Uh, thanks a lot, Derek. This is great. Oh, wow. Is that fantastic? We even got it, haven't even got it out, and it is just wow. So, as you guys can tell, these are two definite different uh, camouflage schemes. Yes, and they have different uh, um, attachments and things like that. Wow. All right, so let's set that one down because we already looked at that one. Uh, go to uh, one of Wednesdays or other brands, and you can probably find a, a video on that one. Little bit of a, kind of a curious thing with the front tire there on the on the hood. I don't know if I can kind of fix that. It's kind of coming off the rim there. I'm kind of twisting and lifting there, and uh, looks a little bit better. But as you see, it was kind of coming off the rim there, pretty good. But anyway, let's get into the video. Let's go right into it here at the beginning, right in the front here. This is awesome. Let's zoom in just a little bit so we can get some better shots. The double uh, sa sabers. Yeah, that's cool. I'm not really sure. Oh, is that a jet? Or what is that over here? Or I'm not really sure what that is. I'm not really sure. But it's got uh, pin, uh, pin hitches there. It's got the, uh, it, it's got a uh, worn winch on it with a winch bumper. Defender on the front grill with the uh, bumped out grill there. Lens details, painted, uh, painted uh, back of the lens is painted silver, but the uh, markers, side markers are, uh, or blinkers and, and side markers are just painted, but very, very cool. But I like that green and brown and tan with the black accents. That is great. Step sides on it. That's pretty cool. Mud flaps there. Same wheels as before, clear interior. Now this is a right hooker as you see there. We'll probably see better on the other side, but it's got this unique roof rack, two spotlights up there. Do they even say Hala on them? Boy, I can't really see it. Two canisters on the sides. I'm not sure if the fly rods or sabers or something that they put in those. <laughs> Let's get around back there. There's that uh, uh, double saber on, on the same side. It's on the same side, double saber on the left, on the front, and then it's on the right, on the back. So those flags stay the same. Yeah, I don't know what kind of uh, weapons those are. I think those are weapons with a number three on the left there with the red and black triangles making it a square. That is cool. Uh, tail lights and things are just painted on. A uh, little bumper or a uh, little tow hitch on the bumper there. Yeah, little uh, breakage there from where they made it from the spur uh, where they molded the plastic. Uh, even the lug nuts and the center of that rim, uh, the lug nuts are painted. That is cool. Oh, yeah, we're getting some good shots here today, yeah. So, yeah, right hooker there. Uh, the side marker has got some silver on it to, to emulate a, uh, um, a mirror. It's got a bench seat in the back. Nothing in the way back there. So, yeah, center council cup there, cup holders, a couple of knobs there to shift with. But yeah, it's just very nice, just very nice. I like that green. That is different green than uh, the others in that black. That is so cool. So yeah, so I just couldn't believe that I had just, I had mistakenly said that they were the same, but they were not. Oh my goodness, so there it is. Mini GT made in China. No other denotions of what it is. Looks like the drivetrain is correct with the offset pumpkins there to one side. Got the exhaust going there. That is awesome. So that is all just one piece there. Metal. So this is metal on metal. Yes. Very, very cool. Yeah, their wheels sometimes looks like they could be 
uh, uh, a little wanting there, especially that front one there. I could, I can work that up a little bit more. You can see how that is a uh, very flexible uh, vinyl rubber, I guess. Yeah, but very, very nicely detailed. These are very nice. Uh, normally these are like 15, um, 90, 15, 99 or so, you know, uh, from regular, uh, you know, retailers and stuff like that. Uh, but he gave me a deal. We were there. I didn't have to pay for shipping. So I just went ahead and, uh, grabbed it. All right. Well, there you go. One of Wednesday with the mini GT. Uh, Land Rover Malaysia Army. I love it. Thank you very much. Go over and visit him on uh, eBay there. Derek Nitro RC. Yes. All right. That's it for a win of Wednesday. Remember, slow traffic. Keep right and have a great Rover day.